Hi guys, my name is Akuredi Adenike. You are highly welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial today, I would like to teach you how to cut and sew this beautiful, stylish half circle sleeve by making my pattern drafting first. Now, let's get into it. Now, here is the paper I'm using for my pattern drafting. I folded it into two equal parts as you can see. Just make sure you get enough paper for your pattern drafting. I'm going to fold it again into two just like this for me to cut out my half circle. So to get the radius of my circle, which is going to be my armhole, I'm going to divide my round armhole by 3.14, which is the formula to get half circle. So my round armhole is 16 inches. I'm going to divide it by 3.14, which is the formula to get half circle. The answer will give me 5 inches. So I'm going to measure 5 inches from the tip here, all round, and connect. So having done that, I'm going to measure the length of my sleeve from this line, which is 9 inches all round, and connect. You can make use of any length you want. Depends on you. Then I'm going to cut it out now, just like this. And after cutting, this is what I have. This is my half circle. So I'll go ahead and move on to my fabric. This is the fabric I'm using and this is the matching lining. So I'm going to fold my fabric now as if I want to cut half circle. Place my pattern on it. I'm just cross-checking whether it's going to be enough. So I'm folding for me to place my pattern paper on it and pin it down please if you are a beginner always do so to make your job accurate at the end of the day i'm done pinning as you can see and i added half inch to it all around for my same allowance so i'm going to cut it out now i'm done cutting i'm going to remove my paper the line is there already as you can see so here is the right side of my here is the wrong side of my fabric and here is the right side of it so i'll go ahead and place my lining on it for me to stitch the edge place it like this on the right side of the fabric and stitch with half inch from here to here i'm done stitching as you can see so i'll go ahead and notch 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 Please do not let your notching touch the sewing place to make your job neat and to avoid any silly mistakes. After notching, I'm going to turn to the right side like this and top stitch on the lining place, not on the fabric. And make sure it's fold like this before you top stitch from the first edge to the second edge. So after top stitching, I'm going to fold it again like this. Let this place align on each other for me to stitch the side seam because I want to hide my side seam from here till where the line is with half inch. I'm done with my side seam as you can see and I've top stitched it. So I'll go ahead and give it a good press. Now I'm done ironing, as you can see, it's very neat and beautiful. I'm notching the center of my sleeve. So this is how it's going to be on the shoulder. So I'll move ahead and show you how it's going to be now. Here's it now. I'll just wait, just demonstrate how it's going to, how you are going to fix it. If you want to make it more beautiful, you can add interfacing to the lining and the fabric. Just make sure you use the softest one of the interfacing for both just to make it just to add more beauty to it so it will be like this and make sure you fold it like this you will just stack it with your hand needle and thread don't stack it on the armhole line move it forward a little bit maybe like 1 to 1.5 inch above the armhole line just like this okay guys if my tutorial today has been helpful to you please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel to support my channel 
If you have any question pertaining to cutting and sewing, you can join me on my Facebook group, Details to Sewing, created by Akurede Adenike. I'm on Twitter and Instagram at Akurede Adenike. Please show some love by liking and following my page on Facebook at Akurede Adenike Sewing Tutorial. You can even follow me on Thread. I'm on Thread. Your gang is on Thread as well. So, let's call it a day. Here is it. As you can see, it's very nice and beautiful. Till I see you in my next video, guys. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Bye.